Hello everyone, it's Abdul here. Today I'm super excited to show you how I built my brand new website ecoNFTS.com using all new Lovable 2.0. And trust me, Lovable 2.0 just dropped and it's pretty insane. You can literally wipe code any app in a matter of minutes. Even if you are a complete beginner, you could do that. And I have spent so many hours just wipe coding different project but this new update it changes everything today i'm not only going to review it but i'll build my live website and show you the different game changing features you need to know as part of today's demo we'll be covering a bunch of topics what are we going to do we'll see the overview of 2.0 for sure and build a live website which is ecoNFTS.com. I've already purchased the domain, so that makes stuff easy for us. And we'll explore different chat modes we have as part of a Lovable 2.0 using visual edits for quick customization and how you can collaborate if you have a bunch of folks who work with you like a team. How can you do that? How can you perform a security scan, which is a major concern for most of the websites like you know how you can enable dev mode how can you download that code and sync it with your github and also we'll publish it on our custom domain and some pro tips on smarter wipe coding and how you can deploy them and at the last i'll also give you my special link using which you can get double credits let's jump into the demo start looking for lovable on google and you should be able to see this first link which is called lovable.dev clicking on this should bring you to the home page if you are a new user you haven't signed up if you haven't seen my previous video on lovable in that i have shown you how you can sign up if you're interested you can take a look at that if not you can click on the third link here which talks about sign up right i because i do have an account i'm just going to click on this lovable.dev and i would be logged into my account because i do have linked it to my google account so you see my email prompting there so let's dive right into building our website to do this i have generated this prompt because i am going to build a eco nfts.com website i have got this prompt from chat gpt i have generated this prompt you can also generate a prompt of your choice and all you have to do is bring it here just paste it this is huge because now you all you have to just is like you know uh, just pass this particular prompt and lovable will be able to take care of what it is needed to build your professional website like you know all i'm saying is build me clean you know uh, pretty, pretty much like a minimalist website with all the features i want like and you know, i want a home page about marketplace everything like, you know for nothing of this i have i'm using my you know scratching my head i'm just using ai to do this for me right i got this prompt i'm just passing this prompt here right with that arrow key here I'm just pushing this prompt now lovable of course it started thinking before that it's giving me features of what lovable 2.0 is all about there's a chat mode security checks smarter and faster integration is what else and edit features perfect so if you see lovable is thinking of what it is supposed to do with this prompt pretty much talking model at the back end and trying to build out a skeleton of what is expected so it's spinning up preview is what it is calling it as well it just took like you know seconds and it has you know a beautifully generated website you know loaded right on our screen here right like it's think through the design layout typography color palette everything it has listed here like you know it wants a responsive uh, design everything it has written here what it is supposed to do and it has generated that particular piece and all that code is present as part of this particular you know code link which is available on the left side right just let's scroll and take a feel of what this website looks like i did nothing here guys you know look at how fast things are happening right and here's our first draft of this website right super clean minimalist just how i wanted it now you can you know uh, do a lot of different stuff once you have reached here right uh, you can uh, of course like you know browse through all the pages which are there on this first draft and let's look at the different features which are available once we go over this the contact page looks good blog page marketplace about everything like you know with five page uh you know tab driven really beautiful right the first thing i would be interested in is like you know 
testing this feature edit feature very important and it's the monster you don't have to use ai for everything you sometimes it is not necessary that ai has to do something you have control over your website like to trade this tool as a companion but not doing everything but you also have control over each and every piece here for example if i have to change something i can use this edit feature and let's say i want to remove this hyphen just giving you an example like you know i can remove that and i don't have to ask ai to do that because everything i ask ai to do it is going to charge me credits right nothing is happening for free of course we are being we are, are being asked to use these tools but you know end of day it comes at a charge and i can do all these changes right i'm changing color of font, font and stuff like that which are straightforward and if i want something specific i should be able to do that so they have introduced this nice feature of edit which the user can automatically do and not what's happening uh, you know a big guy right so i just do um, simple change and i just hit save it gets saved into the code right now with that said let us go one step further right i at, at times what happens is like you know you don't want to use the credits but you want to use uh, you know uh, if you see right now i have used one credit here right but let us say if you want to brainstorm something and you or you want to chat with you know chat gpt and come back here and do stuff that's a hassle is what they have thought so they have introduced this chat feature here just the blue you know icon which i click right now and then here i can chat with the model in the back and then understand different aspects or like and brainstorm this is a monster feature as you don't have to leave this page you can stay on this page brainstorm your ideas and come up which you can implement within your project and this doesn't get or consume any credits which you used to build right? the credits are as it is this is just like you know you're you're consulting ai for you know some observations or you're trying to brainstorm some ideas you could use this this is so helpful because i had to hop between windows to go to different tools to get ideas and come back here and implement but here we can do that right in you know window i'm saying like you know give me some nice observations from this website which i can use to improvise and it has given me a list of observations which i can use to improvise this website all i have to do is once I'm done with this chat because i have got my ideas i can turn this chat off and think of implementing this all i have to do is i give one more command to this and say hey implement all these changes which you have suggested right so just click this and turn this off now it got turned off back to the normal development mode i have to say hey implement these changes for me right all these changes which we have received can you implement these for me on my website that's what i'm asking here right as simple as that now it is going to implement all those changes like you know going to make it seo uh, you know uh, seo savvy and the different aspect which i suggest it is doing that it's thinking and it will do that like you know in seconds right if you see it's writing the uh, you know the code onto the typescript file see it completed it and if i want to go back to the previous version i can click on restart and i can go back but right now it has already refactored our entire you know code you can use this restore button to go back to the previous version if not i can just make use of like you know all those changes which it spoke it has already implemented it's still i have implemented all the key elements to enhance this website well this is as simple as that here on the top code reviewer this is the development mode where you can go and look at all the code it generated none of the i wrote guys like i know nothing about you know typescript I'm, i just know english i'm using english to build this application that's it it's few clicks and english nothing else right so this code viewer is showing me all the code which is present but you know a big challenge we go through is like you know most of these projects will they start maintain this code becomes a very big challenge either it in one of your friends laptop or you know at a specific uh, site or stuff like that right but there should be a common place to store this that is where you know we have the new feature of integrating this particular platform with github with no hassle you should be able to connect this platform with github and then to be able to store this code and they have embedded that piece here something which is very important is how can you share this you know environment or you know this draft so that you can have a team of members who can collaborate with you and work the invite button right to next to publish gives you that option you can invite other team members because we are on a uh, you know a free plan 
we don't uh, see we won't be able to invite anyone but once you go once you want to build a business out of this thing go for the pro plan invite you know your friends and they can also like you, your team could be sitting in antarctica right you know they could be anywhere you can just share this uh, you know this invite and they should be able to come into this and build this site together with you any project for the matter of fact right all of you can you know look at the same version and you know you can build it together that is where the pro plan and the team's plan comes in picture depending upon what you like you can choose but right now we are on a free plan that is why we we get every day five day credits i would say get your hands dirty just jump in there build any random thing which comes to your mind and see and here we are seeing that there is a tab a linking button right next to the invite uh, using which we can connect to github right and it is plain and simple it's very easy what we can do is like you know just go to uh github and because i do have a login there let me preview my code here first so all this code which is there i want to push this code onto git that is the intention of you know using it here because the repository is available anytime and you can share it with anyone and you know it's safe right let me click on let me look for github here and let's see what what are the repositories i do have already if you have not signed up very simple username password just click on sign up for github it's very plain and simple you can sign in because I already have an account, I'm just logging in that. Perfect. There you go. Let me see what are repositories. Just want to make sure. One, two, MCBPM, Test Repo, BPM for Business, Spring Boot, Amunda GCP. Welcome to Consulting. Perfect. These are the only repositories I have. Nothing related to Eco NRS. Let me click on Connect GitHub on the allowable site. And here, it prompts me to connect to my account. All I have to do is just click on Connect GitHub and of course authorize give your credentials and authorize level dot dev to integrate with github just do this just a couple of clicks and you should be able to talk to github very easily it asks you to link your github organization that's also plain and simple just click on link github organizations because that's how they talk to each other you need to have organization within github plain and simple install and authorize is what i would say so that you lovable can you know create read and update repositories within your github account so now it now my uh, account is visible i have to just link i'm clicking link and it target got added is what i see perfect if you have any other organization you can again click on new uh, link new organization and you should be good so it's telling not connected right now because we haven't transferred the project to dub yet all i have to do is click on transfer project and say choose my ppm for business there you go the repository pretty much all the code which we saw here this well organized code has traveled to github just in seconds like you know just with clicks we have moved all that code people who have been doing development they know how challenging it is moving code from their you know local to github you know the setup is very challenging let us see if i can see my code you see i see that eco art canvas web so this is my project i'm building it has traveled here let's see when this was created uh, okay updated now right so it has just now updated the github repository by clicking like by doing few clicks we were able to achieve this this is like insane guys this is one of the updates like which makes when you have multiplayer teams it makes life easy you could be checking in code in seconds and everyone across the globe could be looking at this code just by connecting to github this is a very big feature i mean i think uh, lovable has done really good job there you know hassle free connection and see all that we see on the left side on the lovable site is already available in github anyone in the world who has access to this code can you know look at this code and you know can you know pair with you and you know work with you as a team life is easy guys with this thing trust me so now that we are done with that let us head back to our uh, website and let us click on this publish and see what are the options it gives us to connect our domain if you see domains this is the domain it has created for me eco art canvas web lovable dot app i can just launch this or i can go to manage and add a custom domain i have purchased a domain but i think i need to be a pro uh, you know user to add my domain let's check that out you can also buy a domain from here if you haven't bought 
they are giving one stop shop solution you can buy a domain from here i'm clicking on add a domain because i already have a domain uh, let me click on this buy a domain okay if you want to buy a domain let us uh, we see that you know you should have a pro plan and you can go and buy a domain with free i don't think you can do that only for public projects as well as telling with five daily credits but with pro plan you can do that let us go back let me click on publish again and this is my website let me show you where i have got my website i got it on squarespace this is a very interesting domain i just looked up which are the niche domains and i have bought this uh i bought sometime in february i am trying to implement that so this is if any certificates are needed you can put it here you can buy it anywhere to, for a matter of fact so this is my website ecoNFTs.com. this is what i'm trying to link to that code which we generated i want to link this website to that it's straightforward all you have to do is manage on you know and then add a domain and if you are on upgraded plan you just have to add that and add some dns records and you should be good it's as simple as that nothing fancy here you can try that along with that there is also superbase for any database operations you can connect this to superbase plain and simple all you have to do is come here and click on connect superbase if you have not created a superbase account yet i would recommend doing that it's a no-brainer for anyone who wants to store data of your website or anything right this is the new uh vibe coding apps use superbase big time come here and you know you can just click on superbase and you know i am already logged in so you can use gmail account i'm coming back to level and trying to link this i'm telling back to superbase exactly how it did for uh you know the github same thing there's an organization i want to choose authorized lovable is what i'm going to say let's go this is the organization i have in superbase go back i mean pretty simple integration guys sign up and just connect to that uh, environment connect to superbase is what you have to say and it tells it got connected right i authorized it and it got connected right so it is connected to uh, my project which i have there this is it like you know as simple as that and you should be able to uh, connect to superbase and you know talk to superbase and perform any operations as such so pretty easy integrations to github to superbase and we see let us try to publish this right now let me publish this see if it is working but once i publish this it's available across the web and even if you are looking at this video you can go and look up this uh, you know link and then you should be able to get this website up and running and run yeah perfect see this is universally available i am able to go there all you have to do is come back to your dns records put your settings in and once you're on a pro plan you can just link your website with this thing as simple as that right now we have like literally launched that website connecting that to your real world domain also is pretty straightforward see this website is already loaded and pretty much everything is done and that's it I mean, we built a fully functional, like, you know, professional looking website just within like, you know, 15, 20 minutes. And thanks to Lovable 2.0, right? From branding, like, you know, to uh, being, uh, coordinating with others, visual editing, GitHub integration, like the update is seriously level, guys. If you want to try Lovable yourself, do it and, you know, just see how it works for you. If you like this video, hit that, like, you know, like button, subscribe button, and then let me know in comments, what was your first project with Lovable you did until next time. Stay productive and stay creative. See you soon.